a NASCAR driver, whose brakes had locked up sent members of pit crew flying he crashed into them Sprint Cup's Pocono Raceway event. Brad Kselowski, 31, of Team Penske, was pulling the pit lane, where cars come maintenance and refueling, when he overshot designated area, and hit two of his crew members at the Pennsylvania race. One of the tires originally destined for Kselowski's Ford flew off during the Dizzy's Trust pit stop on Sunday, according NBC Sports. However, his team's workers quickly recovered and completed the stop s pit one of them being hit by car and sent sprawling into the air. The wheel held by the tire carrier slid the car's roof rolled off and later rested in the pit lane, causing NASCAR organizers restart the race on the 66th lap. I'm sorry about that guys. Everybody okay Kselowski asked radio after the event, according Fox Sports. Will it through it? Crew chief Paul Wolf replied and Team Penske later said that one injured. His team was also given a penalty for the loose tire. Despite the pit lane troubles, Kselowski was able bounce back play second in the Indos 10, 400. Matt Ken Sith of Joe Gibbs Racing won the day after contenders, such as Kyle Busch ran out of fuel in the final laps. Jeff Gordon and Dale Earnhardt placed third and fourth. A commentator atching Team Ensk's pit stop mishap said that refuelings had been a weak spot for Kselowski, a former winner of the Sprint Cup and Xfinity Series. Sunday's race also saw driver Cassie Kohani lose control on the pit lane and crash into a wall that separates the area from crews and spectators.